Hello, welcome back to our for All channel. My name is Anastasia and today I get to share with you a very personal and close to my heart art collection that I've done. It's called Tennis I Miss You. The collection has another painting in it. Uh, it has been sold to a very special person who's helped me so much in my career as a tennis coach. I've been teaching tennis at the University of Alberta for the past 12 years and it's an incredible place. I'm so honored to have that opportunity to teach tennis to kids, adults, and work with incredible mentors and uh, amazing coaches. And it's just been a joy. So when the lockdown happened and we were off, I believe November, December, and January, it started getting really tough. Uh, especially like January when January happened so that was our second month uh, being in lockdown and we haven't taught kids for quite some time and we haven't been on the courts for quite some time a lot of the coaches really started to miss it sometimes it's okay for us to take a vacation for one week or two weeks three weeks max but we've never been gone for more than a month uh, at a time for justification and not teaching tennis. So I personally missed it so much. I missed teaching, I missed stepping on the court, I missed playing. So I came up with this Tennis I Miss You collection. So the first painting is very bright and I called it I Miss You 1.0. When players in Alberta here in Canada play tournaments, the beginners are usually playing in a 1.0 and then you keep going up 2.0, 3.0, 4.0, 5.0 and then after 5.0 we just call it open so yeah there's that little play on words here so the first painting I started to do something that I've never seen before which is I decided to paint inside the strings with uh, different colors. I've never seen that before and I was like, when I did it, I was like, man, I'm on to something. And that movie, that uh, painting actually got over 2000 views on Instagram. So that was quite exciting. So I decided to carry on with it and keep that signature string painting in all the other paintings, as you can see here. So the second painting, this is the 2.0, Tennis I Miss You 2.0. This is Dusk Tennis. If you got on the court at 5 p.m. at night and you've been playing all night and the sun starts to set, it's that good, good feeling of what a workout you had and what a great partnership you've just experienced with your partner. That's that feeling in this painting. That's what it's about is that really good feeling when you've played for so long and you're putting your rackets down and you're ready to go home and you'll forever, forever remember those moments. So that's what this painting is signifying to me. Then I decided to paint tennis 3.0. So it's a mini, mini tennis uh, painting. There's also mini tennis. And this one is actually sunrise, sun, sunrise tennis. So some of our young junior players, they play at 6 a.m. or 7 a.m. And when you're out on the court, you get there and the air is fresh and the sun just starts to come up. And that's what that painting is about, is that good feeling of waking up early and getting a great hit in or a great lesson in. And then finally, there's Tennis 4.0. This is actually done in acrylics. It's on a board and there's lots of gold. University of Alberta, our main colors are green and gold. So I just thought to put that in here. And basically here, you're just tying up your shoe before you go on the court. It's that good feeling that every player knows just to have it just right. You put your racket down and you're there. Just It's the first step that you do before you get on any court. Or sometimes, let's say you're coming in, you're playing mini court tennis and you're like, ah, oh, the shoe's a little loose. So you sit down and you tie it up a little more. So it's very personal. I hope you guys enjoy this series. If you're interested in any of these paintings, this one is a silk painting, so is this one. 
uh, please check out my website. There's a link up top on my main YouTube page and you can definitely buy these. So anyways, I hope you also enjoy the video and see how I've created all of these. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys soon. Bye. Thank you.